<laughs> you take it out.
I can hear you out there. Help me, please. What's wrong, sir? Oh, I heard this awful noise. What's going on? There's been a lockdown. A lockdown? No. Oh, God, please, not today. Well, what's so special about today? I was scheduled to undergo a, a medical procedure. It's a private matter. I'd, I'd, I'd rather not talk about it. So just help. Sir, I'm wondering if you've seen anything suspicious lately. I haven't seen anything in over 40 years. Ah, that's your condition. I... I, I really don't feel comfortable talking about it. Fine, I won't waste your time then. Hey, wait, I did hear something. Quiet footsteps, deliberate, heavy breathing, angry, not hiding, hunting. Hmm, anything else? The smell, it seemed uh, oddly familiar, reminded me of my childhood. Your childhood? Yes. My family lived outside the city with all manner of creatures. When it would rain, the smell would be similar. Mm. Listen to me. The building's on lockdown. There's no way I can help you now. But I can get whoever's responsible for this if you help me find him. Don't try to talk. There's another way. Subject approved. Commencing neural interrogation. Amir, is that you?
<sighs> Thanks, kid. This should get me through the week. What the fuck, man? I told you not to show up during the day. Fucking slop again. It's called soup. I dig in, it's not getting any better.
look like the day. Rocks don't last in here. Yes! Finally! to forget. I've always wondered, were you scared? Of me, I mean. No, I can see right through you. I saw that underneath all your muscles and tattoos, you were like a big, wounded animal. Lost. Alone. Hey, at least you knew what you were getting into. Yeah, yeah I, I guess, guess I, I did. did. sickness and in health forsaking all others to have and to hold from this day forward until death do us part any regrets no
good. Neural interrogation aborted. Subject expired during questioning. Emergency extraction procedure successful. Well, you got your last fix. Hope it was worth it. Strange looking hair. Not human. Not animal. The voice box implant. Not uncommon among longtime feed addicts. Refilled. More feed. Some of the counter painkillers. The numbers on them might lead me to Amir's clients.
credit chip. Handy for storing off the grid currency. Well, well, you must be Helen. What else are we hiding in here? Chiron Corporation ID. Low level clearance, but still valid. Leaving the crime scene. Pursuing a lead. The victim's wife could still be in the building. Maybe the neighbors know something. KPD, I'd like to have a word. It's about time you showed up. What the hell is going on? Why are we under lockdown? Most likely a malfunction. I'm still looking into it. Well, you ain't looking in the right places. Because I don't know nothing. Notice anything suspicious or unusual? Other than the lockdown, I mean. Well, the couple from 104 were making an awful lot of noise a while back. More than usual, I mean. The girl ran off, and then it got quiet. Did you see where she ran off to? I ain't one to snoop. But... Judging by the footsteps, I'd say she ran down to the courtyard. Anything else you can tell me about them? What? The couple? Don't know them that well. The girl seems nice enough. Not sure about the guy, though. What can you tell me about the guy? Amir? I think he's called. He looks tough, but... He's got the yellow eye, you know? Twitches like a junkie. Probably sells the shit, too. How do you know that? What, the deal? I see him sneak around during the night, carrying packages and stuff. I doubt he's the goddamn postman. What about the girl? Oh, she, she's a trooper. Works double shifts at Chiron to support that ex-con asshole of a husband. Any idea what she might be doing for them? Can't be too important or she wouldn't be living in this shithole. Explains the look on her face, though. What do you mean by that? Worn out, fidgety, jumping at shadows. Working for the corporation has that effect, I guess. Does this kind of stuff happen often? You ever see a husband get violent? Nah, nah, he ain't a wife beater or anything like that. He's just messed up. Then again, ain't we all? Anything else out of the ordinary? Anything at all? 
Well, other than some asshole bringing animals into the building, I'd say that's pretty much it. Animals? Yeah, I could, uh, I could swear I heard something growling in the hallway earlier. I'd inform the janitor, but, eh, he'd lose the plot midway through the talk anyway. Thanks. You've been very helpful. <laughs> that's new. KPD, I'd like to ask you some questions. Certainly, officer. Always glad to do my civic duty. Seen or heard anything suspicious lately? Neighbors acting weird? Actually, I did hear some noises coming from 104. Then the woman stormed out of the apartment and ran off. Did you see where she went? Well, no, I didn't actually see her. I could smell her, you see. Smell her? Don't tell me you can't. That cheap crap she pours over herself, the entire hallway reeks of it. She probably thinks it makes her seem ladylike. I see. I got it. Thanks for your help. I could hear her panting, too. Moaning like the whore she is. You did, huh? Yeah. Biggest fucking cock tease you've ever seen. Always toying with me, bending over when reaching for the lock, all naked underneath her clothes. She knows I'm watching, too. She likes to make me itch, cooped up with that junky meathead. I mean, what does he have that I don't? They're all like that, you know? Fucking mongoloid bitch. Now, I hope she gets what she fucking deserves, so that she knows she's fucked up. She'll have no choice but to come to me, begging. But it'll be too late, you hear me? Too late! Okay. How about you shut the fuck up? Well, that was certainly uncalled for. Good day to you, officer. <laughs>